eyes are the windows to our soul. In addition to being one of the most important sense organ providing the gift of sight, our eyes play the most important role in facial aesthetics. Probably the first thing that you notice in a person is their eyes and all the emotions are expressed through it. In this video, we will be taking you through the various aspects of cosmetic rehabilitation of an empty socket. Traumatic eye injury, ocular malignancies, endophthalmitis unresponsive to medical treatment, painful blind eye or thysical eyes with severe cosmetic defects may necessitate evisceration or enucleation. The choice of surgery depends on specific indications and contraindications in the given clinical scenario. There exist situations where an exenteration is indicated in the presence of advanced ocular tumors or a refractory contracted socket where exenteration prosthesis is the only option for cosmetic revival. Congenital ocular developmental anomalies like anophthalmia and microphthalmia also require timely intervention and management for replacing the volume, for adequate bony development and restoring the cosmesis with ocular prosthesis. I have never seen the world with two eyes. We went to the doctor again and then we figured out that there is no vision in the eye. The eye kept on shrinking down. He gave an uh, idea about this uh, prosthetic eye. Removal of the eye is a difficult decision for both the patient and the surgeon and hence the last resort. It can have an intimidating impact on social life of a patient whether it is meeting with friends or colleagues, finding an understanding partner or making a mark in the society. Social phobias coexist with these conditions. During that point of time, obviously my confidence level was very low. Whenever people used to see me, used to see me as a disabled person. Artificial replacement of a lost organ can overcome these fears and insecurities, improving the overall personal development. After uh, I got the eye, I started doing well uh, in my school as well as uh, during my college days. I never felt that uh, I was missing something. The quality of the work which uh, the people have put in in building this new prosthetic eye is amazing. You know yourself that you don't have one eye, but the rest of the world won't even uh, be able to figure it out. The volume of the eyeball removed is 7 milliliters. In 1885, Philip Henry introduced the most important step for achieving aesthetically acceptable socket, that is, volume replacement. The 70 to 80 percent of the deficit volume is restored by an implant and rest by the prosthesis. This gives the patient a natural looking eye, although non functional, with relatively good motility, aiming for excellent cosmesis. If we fail to replace the lost volume, the socket undergoes contraction and hence a facial deformity. In these situations, socket reconstruction and fitting a custom-made ocular prosthesis helps achieve a near normal appearance in congenital and acquired conditions. Ocular prosthesis has been described since ancient Roman and Egyptian times and the present-day custom-made acrylic ocular prosthesis has seen a revolutionary change from the hand-painted clay models to glass eyes which was used during the World War II. Ocular prosthesis are of two types. The stock eyes that are ready-made and available in bulk and the custom-made prosthesis which are made and carved to the size and shape of the individualized socket of the patient. Making and fitting of a perfect customized ocular prosthesis requires a highly skilled technical acumen tailored to the sockets. The cosmetic and functional results render social and psychological rehabilitation to the patient. An ocularist fit a custom made prosthesis after the socket has healed typically 4 to 6 weeks after the surgery.
Ocularistry is an art which requires creativity with highly skilled clinical acumen. To think about it, the ocularist is an artist who does not want the world to notice their art. Hence, for others not to notice the reality of it is something they aim for. No two eyes or sockets are similar. Adult prosthesis typically lasts for 5 to 6 years and might require repolishing or renewal for better finish. Resizing of the prosthesis in case of children is required as they grow and they need to be kept on a close follow-up. नंगे रे स्कूल ली वो बकार रे स्कूल उड़ रहा रे सो रो सो नंगे सो बकार नहीं ला पूरा आगे आगे इधर लाइन में और इलान नोट जाकर नंगे मंसले तरा अंदस्ता है तो आउट तरा नंगे वाला नंगे किल वाला ये तो उन तरह मंसले कोटता है तो वो ये वाक सप्पा वर्ष करने ये सप्पा नंचे एस्पेक्ट लग दोसी इधर मेरे ऑपरेशन मारे करने को उस तरह ना नार्मल है इतने ना माना ज़्यादा को नार्मल है ना कहाँ स्टेज में ना नार्मल है ड्राइविंग मारते हैं इतने नार्मल है ज़्यादा करने को वाला टेज में यार को ना तो आईडी पिछले ये तो ओबर को बुर्ती डाला था आत्रा तो छनाई मार आईडी पिछले ये कुछ इधर the team comprising of oculoplasty surgeon and an ocularist work together to provide the patient the best possible cosmetic restoration of the empty socket, thus filling the emptiness in their lives as well. I would say it's worth it. At the end of the day, you, you get a better version of yourself.